actually met uh, first at an award ceremony, which was bizarre because at that award ceremony we discovered that we lived less than a catapult's rock ping away from each other, you know, which was really funny. I remember saying when I gave the award that it saved us all a lot of time if I could have just popped it in a letterbox. <laughs> as well when I came up to Martin's house usually after the pub or, or uh, thereabouts and uh, just sat playing and um, it was something that I'd not done for quite a long time myself and it, 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 it kind of struck me obviously how brilliant a musician he is and um, but that how good things sounded in this kind of setting really rather than in any sort of formal or setting like a studio or something it was just really already the ideas between both of us it just seemed to be really natural both me and Martin didn't know that much really about each other's music which actually was a really healthy thing eventually Martin was kind enough to give me a, a, a few of his records. When I heard those, it was very radically different from what I heard around the kitchen table in either mine or Martin's house, was just the purity of it. Just to hear a, a record of such purity where it's just Martin and it's it basically it's Martin Simpson and that's what it is and what it is is fucking beautiful you know and uh, yeah to be a tiny little part of that was is a good thing treasure that record definitely. <laughs> 